could have asked for a better trade. At least it's a one for one. Would have loved to take down basic, but Falcons arriving at the third Without turtle. Without the Moscow coming in, Dax still somehow managed to take. <laughs> oh man! Hey Trex, how you feeling, buddy? Thanks. I'm not feeling. Damn, the, the other the people Moscow. brought Mr. the Alpha win rate up. Oh. Same picked it again. Oh. It's gonna go down how again. People, why are you is, laughing for? What, Chris, okay, why are you laughing for? Pick, why are you laughing still, for? I'm being. I turns around. He's not actually taking his purple off. He's coming for the contest, knowing that Falcons AP brand are all around Cold World, trying to force something out from F Cap's side. Great off. It lands on the three targets. Can he? Wait a minute. F Cap's side. Great off. It lands at the front. People, why is, are you laughing for? What, Chris, okay, why are you laughing for? Pick, why are you laughing for? I'm being. Nice. Can he steal Kyle? Finds the turtle. Minoan Fury gets the knock of a first blood. It's going to be Cold War who goes down as Moba Zane takes out Flap Teasy. Mielo ends up dying alongside them. Bruh. In Cold World, he's got nothing left in the tank. So, C9, this turtle dance. Kind of looking a little different. Flicker forward coming in from Flap Teasy to get the penalty zone, but it looks like he's out of position with no follow up and a backup. Kyle only gets the double here. Pretty. All it took was an Oogie Shadow kill mm -hmm. and the sudden burst on. Fred. That's deja vu for F Cap. Oh, oh. Another two for one. Oh. Now in the back line, basic. Ah, uh, he gets hit still. He dashes out of the way, but the dive is complete. All it nope. took was an Oogie Shadow kill. Mm -hmm. And the sudden burst on... I think it's totally fine that Cold World goes down there. I think it's really unlucky that Boba Zane actually dies there. Now, Mark UT, he still has his passive. He should die here regardless of Kyle. Really great position. I'll hey. add an extra three on top of that. Okay. All right. Well, to be fair, there have been a few heroes picked up. Now, so, oh, Zane in trouble. Oh, my. Sky Piercer. Unlucky. Yeah. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. Uh, slightly up. And ironically, I think... I, I think it's between Flap TZ and Mielo as of right now, right? Ooh. Based on, I mean, Mielo is two levels down. Oh no, oh, he got hit by the, the edge of it. No. no. Let's see how this is going to play out because Boba Zane, he probably doesn't want to be there longer than he should. He still has Spear of Alpha to get on out of there. And even the Fridge of Wait, that's a kill coming in from Mark UT. And now they start to initiate. They get in. Phew! The next the fall doesn't get out of there as Mielo is going to follow up to try and get as many stragglers as possible. He gets hit by the penalty zone. And then Super Marco fires one. Kyle Tease, he's already got life. But Boba Zane says, No, I move forward. I don't back down. He never gives up. Oh my God, Cold World saves Boba Zane's life with a flick away in the drag! Recognize it too. Oh, BOD for the side of Kyle. All right. That is a BOD, yes. Diversion in. Kyle TZ picked up by few. Here's the fight. Boba Zane does get the uh, get the Lord, but now the Fringe of Breath is already down. Kyle finds Core instantaneously as a Minoan Fury is going to be coming out and unlucky because right now he's just chaining kills upon kills upon kills! This is Moba Zane's comeback in the international stage. <laughs> oh, it's funny because it's true. Right. Yep, and of course there's the penalty zone you're thinking about too. Mm -hmm. Big ticket AOE old from Ogwin and Flap now that they find it. Oh, they find it outside of the map. They at least get Moba Zane as well as Cold World. What a fast play from Falcons AP Brand. And he threw the SOD, but really there's not much you can do as a Moscow at this point. I think he's just gonna be like, All I it. want is that if somehow at some point they have a gold lead on, uh, on FCAP, no toss toss. Oh. Just don't toss toss, all right? It can't get any worse <laughs> unless you guys toss toss. I disagree. Point again, 14 minutes in. Big Lord in mid, top lane in jeopardy. This could be it. Oh, once again. They're going to be using Glacier very early on, but they're going straight for the Crystal. They're ignoring a majority of the members, and FCAP take this 1-0 against C9. <laughs> What is your message to Coach Midnight? Come on, man. Put on some show. Damn! Do you have a message you want to give out to Coach Ducky? 
Uh, <laughs> see you back in Manila. <laughs> Why are you laughing for? What, Chris, why are you laughing for? Why are you laughing for? I'm being shady. And considering Basic's current standings against Super Marco, it's not looking good. Uh-huh. Check this out. Falcon TV ran everywhere right now. All four members here. Oh, there's the Earth Shatter onward. Oh, he flickers away. Penalty zones on top of it, but that just means that he's going to get just run down by Flap Teasy. I would. I would strangle Milo. <laughs> Already been popped. It's 2v1 up on that top side of basic. He's trying to get on out of there, but he's giving a little low. Ogren again plays it really well, but here comes the cavalry here as Mark QT is able to find the trade back. Super kind of beating out his friend just to get a free kill. Yeah. <laughs> Still, I think that's a win for Falcon TP Brent. Oh no, Super Marco! Taken down and down bottom the trade. Yep. <laughs> This tower. Nope. Unless Count Easy coming through looking for the charge. Uh oh. There's uh. the stun. Fuse in trouble. All right. Gets away from the appraiser's wrath at the very least. Mobazane still alive. Mountain Chakra to reconfirm positions. And Fuse, he's got, he cannot let go of the left stick. Mobazane now in some trouble as, oh, like it pounces. Well, Super Marco finds it. <laughs> Mountain Shocker checking in on positioning. Wall charge! It hits on towards Ogun's side. Earth Shatter doesn't connect as well as Basic leaps past him, but away from the Zaman Force, the key doesn't slow Ogun down. Fine. <laughs> Forcing out a DPZ from Yellow. At least he didn't have to use his flicker. So a defensive rotation from Cloud9 right what? now. Cold World gets Gogwin. Oh, uh, okay. I mean, I um, wasn't it's... Cold World there too, you know? Zane as well, just with the uh, Ogun problem. As now we get into the fight, Ogun. You forced to use the primal wrap very early. Zavin Force coming out basically a little early here, but Kyle, great game sense, locks him down, forces the purifier, instantly takes him out with the primal wrap. Nicely done as they get on out of there. Sorry, the appraiser's wrap. So we see Flapsy try to get on out of there. Nah, few. As much as he wants to save his boy, the Nether Realm only has so much HP, but they do push C9 between Mark Hudy and Moba Zane to clear the waves. And look at this! Cold world from the back! Oh, penalty zone as well onto Ogwen's side, but here comes Kyle as well as Flap TZ to zone away the back line to isolate their targets as Basic left all by himself, forced to dash back out of the situation. Traded by the roamer of a Cloud9, but again, it just led to, oh, Super Marco coming forward to the chase! He finds... <laughs> Lord spawning in about 10 seconds from now. I think Falcon ZP Brin can use this while to Whoa. some time. Oh! Whoa! The Zaman Force backwards, but now the Feather Airstrike looks good. Nether Realm comes out to save the members of Falcon's AP Brent. Whoa! The emergency eject button as soon. No. Marco! Ha! about it he's gonna get a uh, some some tick damage i suppose i suppose i think that c9 are also wait hold on basic now maybe in some trouble has to use zaman force last insanity does come out but basic on uh, oh hold on now with the feather into the mountain shock another realm could just come down immortality will be out whoa oh my marco! god super marco flickers forward he wants another one give it to him holy cow as he fights two in the middle of all five members of c9 make it a triple and now they're Cracking down on the crystal. If they keep up the heat, they might be able to make a maniac just in time here. And that's what Super Marco wants. He goes in, finds another one. Maniac! Give him the savage underneath it! Come on! Dive him! They're gonna try! Mark Uni says no! The bees in Saudi go wild as you can hear them chant for AP Bread! Oh my god!